Okay, um, this is a tape haul from Japan. Um, and I'm gonna open it. Very excited. There's some really, really nice ones inside here. Uh, I won these on eBay. And uh, I can't wait. start okay oh, back cells oh, very well packaged Sony oh look some more here what I'm gonna do is I'm going to open them and go through them one by one. Okay, first up, uh, Sony. This is a uh, HF46. Um, I've never seen one in a 46. Um, these are good tapes, very clear. A great type one. Um, this is from 1985. It's got the grey hubs and the uh, white rollers. HFS 90. I really like these. Um, I've said that before. These are great um, type ones. Um, this one is also from 1985. It's got the Grey hubs with the orange fasteners. <laughs> oh, look at this! I mean, I've been looking for one of these for a long, long time. 1985 HF Pro 46. Um, this one has got the oversized jumbo hubs. Look at that! I just can't stop looking at it. Ceramic tape guide. These are very, very, very hard to get, and the whole world and his mother is after them. Anyway, look at that. If you had this in 1985, you probably would have been the dog's bollocks. Okay, Maxell. Um, it's a UR120, um, Japanese market. Uh, yeah, it's got this extra detail that you don't normally see in Europe. Um, and side A is red, side B is green. Nice little touch. This is an XL1. Um, a type 1 from Maxell which is highly spoken of because it's a good cassette yeah, very very nice very very noise this is a UD ultra dynamic um, look at that beautiful colors Late 80s. Yeah. Stunning. UD2, which is the type 2. Oh, look at that. Oh, jolly nice. That's a 50. And this is a UR. 90. 
again Japanese market uh, as you can tell by the uh, script here um, the seller actually threw this in as a freebie believe it or not so I will definitely be buying from him again that is so cool look at that telling you how to wind it on with a pencil I love it 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 okay next uh, TDK and this is an AD46 from 1988 uh, Japan market and uh, look at those hubs <laughs> they're like the wheels off a train or something my god um, that is, oh look what's in here Listing and uh, oh wow, never even seen these. Look at that! Oh my god, the label blue on one side. And oh, I'm stunned. These are absolute. I, th I won these, um, the TDKs. There were six, and I won them for god, I think it was two or three euros. So they were a complete and utter steal. Um, that's a 50 yeah and he even has them packed in order numerical order just that's that's how fanatical this guy is I love that um, that's the 50 again the 50 has the jumbo hubs um, oh yeah it's actually telling you what it's in the range here yeah, very exciting stuff yeah, goes down well with me. Uh, this is a 54. Again, these are all identical. Um, it's the whole range, I'd say. A 54. And a 60. Um, wow, they're gorgeous. They're gorgeous. Absolutely gorgeous. Uh, this is an 80. I have very few 80 minute cassettes. I don't think I actually have any. Yeah. Uh, and a 90. Yeah, these are absolutely stunning. Nice addition to the collection. Um, he also threw in a few extras and the TDK A20. He's a very short cassettes that seem to be very popular in Japan um, probably for talking into I'd say back in the day as a 10 and you kind of post them to your friends it's, it's almost like a I don't know um, and there's, this is another one um, TDK CDing one there's only 10 minutes on this so um, be handy for a demo tape or something um, Maxell, you are um, 30. That's 15 minutes aside to all those people who don't know what cassettes are. And this is a 10, five minutes aside. Um, yeah, these he, he gave me these as a bonus, and they were meticulously packaged and whatnot. Wow, I am stunned. Okay, so next I'm off to do some tests to see how they sound and you can guess the rest. Thanks for watching.